Hi guys, welcome back to It's Ashland's World. Today I'm going to be showing you my frog's newly updated cage, which you could have saw in my room tour, or my salamander I caught yesterday. I'm going to be showing you its cage, so let's get started. Here's my salamander's cage. Some of you might say it's too small, but once you see the size of the hen, this is really almost too big, but it's just the right size, so let me sit it right there. Which, we have this fridge I keep all their food in that has to be frozen or refrigerated, but let's just do it this way. There we go. This is the lid. It's got little holes, and then on the top, it's got that. This is my salamander I'm showing you, by the way. You can pull it off like that. There's the enclosure. Here's the inside. There's some moss, a water dish, and there's the salamander. <clears throat> there's some more moss, little pebbles. Well, they're not pebbles, they're river rocks. He gets under them, and there's moss on the top, and then there's a piece of grass and another piece of moss. And there's the little salamander. There he is, so there's his cage. So, yeah, guys, <clears throat> that's my salamander's cage. Now I'm going to be showing you my frog's cage. I'm just going to sit it like that. I'll click it back on in a minute. There we go. It just clicked on in one snap. So there's a side view. There he is again. So one good click. So bye. So bye-bye to the salamander. And you probably saw my watch in the background, but there's my watch. Moving to this, this is my Gray Tree Frog's 10-gallon tank. <clears throat> it has a lid on because he's a tree frog. He will climb out. I'm going to take the lid off. We just redid this tank yesterday. It used to be all land, but we redid it. So here's the inside. First, we have a brick right there. And this stick with moss on it. Then a piece of moss put on top of the stick by me, but that other moss on it is dying and I didn't put it on there. And then we have that little food dish. Well, it's our food dish we can use in the house, but we gave it to him. And then there's moss on top of it. We have a stick right there because he loves to get on sticks. And then we have another stick right there. And then we have that little thingy roo right there and some grass under it. And then here is my tree frog. Well, it's like he wants to swim right now, but there he is. Let me see if he'll let me grab him. Yeah, he'll let me grab him. I'm going to get into some better lighting. There's my gray tree frog. He's climbing up my arm. Whoa. Well, I guess you can just jump right on into the water. And now I went into the pot, but a brick with a piece of moss, that little bowl with a piece of moss, a stick, another stick right there, which he just knocked that stick down. There's the other stick, and then he has that little hide, and then there's rocks under it, and then a pot and moss on the top. And then we just have some plants floating around. So there's that tank, and I better put the lid back on. So thanks for watching my frog's tank and my salamander's tank. So yeah, guys, bye. Thanks for watching.